Okay, um, in class, do you remember what we, uh, what we taught about in our previous class? Plant things. Um, we talked about, we talked about, um, we talked about, oh, I, uh, I know now, celebrations. That is correct. So, uh, do you remember in our previous class, we mentioned that we were going to cover, well, especially a new content this week. And now we are gonna have another unit, a new one. So, especially in regards of this new unit, which is unit number, number four, let me show you here. Okay. Teacher, Alex I have it visas today. Oh, you have pizzas, you say? Yes, and I eat. Oh. Yeah, I eat all. Oh my God. <laughs> you have a good time. You had a good time. And drink new tea. Oh, nice. So it makes me feel like hungry. <laughs> Are you eating today? I'm sorry, say that again. Are you eating yes? Well, I ate. I, I already have food, oh, but you know, yeah. pigs. I also like pig. I also like pigs. <laughs> oh, yeah. So let me share my screen to you, Bonnie. Give me one second. Okay. Today we we'll learn. Today we we'll learn. Chichi, today we we'll learn Amazon rainforest. Lesson. Lesson. Unit three. All right. Unit four. And lesson, lesson four. Oh, lesson. Give me a second. Chichi, what is the rainforest? Uh, you, you mentioned rain in forest. Is that what you said, Bonnie? What is rainforest? Well, actually, that is the forest. Like, you know, the ones that have a lot of trees. Uh, things like that you know those those type of forests in which um you can find them in a place in an area that rains a lot that there are large trees like very tall tall trees those are the well-known rainforests okay i understand now so especially this type of forest one of the characteristics one is they have is that the majority of them so you can see you can see that in the majority of those rainforests so there are many species of animals okay i'm gonna stand now especially in like you know forests for example in the amazon do you know the amazon no well the amazon uh, amazon is located in south america all right, there, there are a lot of trees. This is one of the lands of the world. So there, there are a lot of trees, like tall trees, millions and millions of okay, trees. Okay, I'm gonna stand now. So let me show you, unit number four. My, my, no, I always say if Snow White play, learn with teacher, she always bored because teacher always she speak English, not speak Vietnamese like her teachers. <laughs> All right. So if you mean if she speaks with me? Yes, because she always like have a teacher Vietnamese learn English like kind of like blah 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 like that like kind of like book like that she, on, she only speaks but in in english they say this is a book but in her teacher but in teacher snow white they say can i a book they say like that in vietnamese yes oh wow snow white and snow white say if if teacher play games with i teacher always play english game not vietnamese games and she may understand the type of games easily because as she is uh, 
a little a little child that is gonna be fine for her for her because she will learn the language naturally. So let me show, share my screen to you. Okay. So our today lesson is comparisons. All right. So today oh. we're gonna be talking about that. Meanwhile, it is open and bunny. And uh, yeah, this one. So then we are having the mystery. Meanwhile, it is opening. Let me use this one. Okay. Okay. So meanwhile, it is opening. All right. So look at here. So now we are talking about comparisons. And I want you to look at that. This is the vocabulary of the lesson. Okay, I want you to read this, Bonnie. Colorful Mako. Colorful Mako, all right. So, and what is the next one? Um, plain, plain. Plain, yeah, that's right. Egret, egret. Egret. Uh, let me just show you. This is the plain egret. Let me show you. Let me just go back to the previous one. Allow me a second. I think this okay. one is already open. Okay, this is the plain egret. So then let's continue. The first one is the colorful, the colorful macro. This one, colorful macro, and this one, Bonnie. Plain egret. That's right. So let's continue with the other one. Do you know this one? This one is very fast. It, this one runs very fast. Do you know the name of this animal? No. Um, Tangla? Uh, it's dangerous. Dangerous jaguar. Dangerous. Dangerous jaguar. Jaguar. Yeah, because it's dangerous. Jaguar. It's kind of like a cat, but it's dangerous and so fast. It's, it's a wild cat. And it have a, have a black Dog. Yeah, uh, kind of like black dots and brown, brown and black dots around its body. So let me show you here. And what about this one? Dolphin. Okay, what kind of dolphin is this one? Um, she's the dolphin. Friendly. All right. Friend, friendly river dolphin. Friendly river dolphin. But teacher, why the dolphin was color pink? <laughs> well, maybe this is a this is a nice dolphin. Oh, because I like the I like they have a same color. I like yeah. the dolphin have the the color is um little white and black. Gray, gray. Yeah, normally like gray in in white. Oh well, the majority of the time is is gray. They, uh, you know, actually. I really like to try a dolphin. Usually, the majority of time, the color is gray. I remember, I remember myself going in a cruise ship, and then I saw many dolphins around. Like you know, around around us, I was in a cruise in a cruise ship and then I saw many of them like jumping like that. Oh, yes. I, I didn't see any dolphin yet. They are amazing and they are very smart. Do you believe that dolphins scared sharks? 
To Tark? Teacher, what is Kirk Tark? I mean, sharks. Like, you know, the the sharks, the ones you can you can see in the water? Um, Do you know what are the sharks? No. This one? Let me show you. So this is a shark. Where? Let me show you. They have the ability to scare many sharks, like this one. Can you see? Shark? Shark? Yeah, that is a shark. Shark or shark? Yeah, dolphins, they have like a certain type of wave, all right? Or, or they, they just like make a, a certain type of sounds vibration sounds in which yes. chocolate gets they have. They have. incredible incredibly amazing if you see the charts physics all right their physical structure so you you say you may say how is it possible that a dolphin is going to scare a shark incredible Did you? i have a book how dolphin in this let them Oh, very good. Let him see what page is it. Fish, dolphin, no, fish, shark, dolphin. Is this shark? Did you have a shark in here too? Oh yeah, it's, this is a big one. But teacher, I don't know what is this. Let me see. This animal. I can't see it very well, but it seems to be an octopus. This to... animal, teacher. Oh wow. Seems to be a certain type of octopus, something like that. I always have the that question what is that animals okay so now let's continue what about this one what what type of animal is this one bunny where did you this one what kind of animal is this one the animal is energetic spider monkey energetic right energetic, energetic spider, spider monkey spider monkey and what about this one Clam smoot. Cam slav. Cam slav. Cam slav. 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 That's right. So, okay. so then we're gonna review all of these animals. I know that some of you then maybe maybe some new vocabularies to you, or did you know these words before, Bonnie? Where did you? Did you know the names of of Did you know the names of these animals before? Yes, I know. I have it in the book, but in okay. another book. Okay, fantastic. So now we are going to learn some comparatives, all right, with long and short right. adjectives. So let me show you this here, Bonnie. Okay, so if we are going to compare like from one animal or somebody or something to another thing, so we are going to use more than. Can you see here? Yes, I can see it. So for example, if I say, let me see. Uh, my coat is called more colorful than the a great. Uh, that is correct. So this is the example. I know you, we can also set another example like let me see thomas is thomas is more 
Okay. Let's say it's more intelligent. For example, You'll write in the chat? Yeah, in the chat. Where I can't see. The mark. So look at there. For example, Thomas is more intelligent than Mark. So that is an example. Teacher, where is Mark? I'm sorry, where is Mark? Who is Mark? Well, Mark is just a name, like the name of somebody. So I'm just saying like Thomas is more intelligent than Mark. That's just an example. Can I write more? Yeah, absolutely. So, but remember <laughs> that you're gonna use for the comparison bunny, you're going to I use more write. than, all right? For example, Thomas is more intelligent, intelligent than, than the, the thing, the person or the noun you are going to use. I will suggest you to make an example, to write an example to see how you do it. Okay, I'm ready. Can you see? Mm, in this one, <laughs> it's different because uh, this is a, an irregular adjective. So what? in this- you what? And this one is different. We don't use it this way, like more good. We say better, better, better than. This one we use it better than, all right? Because oh. that is, this one is irregular. Oh my, the Alex is better than I. Let me show you. I don't think so. You are better than me. <laughs> so let me see. I want you to read this example. Let me show you here. And I think I, the I will sing better than you. Okay, let me see here this one. Can you read this sentence, Bonnie? Where did you? This one, this sentence. Can you read it? The Marco. The Marco is more colorful than the Egret. That is correct. So let's see the other one. So let's see now some questions. I write using the comparative. The don't, Marco, rem don't remember. Does the, Mar can, does the Marco is colorful than the Egret? Yeah, don't forget that um, also uh, we use the comparative the this way. More the yes. adjective than. More adjective in between than. So now we are going to learn how to make questions with those. So look at here. So what is the question here, Bonnie? Um, is, is the Marco more colorful than the great? Yes, is it? No, it isn't. Not, it isn't. That's right. Yes, it, yes, no, it no. is. Yes, it yes, is. It is. Uh, no, affirmative. The affirmative. Yes, it is. Not, it isn't. So that is gonna be in case that is that that one of the cases is applicable. Do you understand? For example, okay. if if it is not like that, you say no, it not it isn't. But if it is like this, you say yes, it is. So now, Bonnie, let's continue with the vocabulary. So I want you to listen and repeat. So look okay. at that. Page 32, Unit 4, The Amazon Rainforest. Lesson 1, Comparisons. Okay. A. Listen, point, and say. 1. Colorful macaw. Colorful macaw. 2. Plain egret. Plain egret. Three. Dangerous jaguar. Okay. Four. Friendly river dolphin. Friendly river dolphin. Energetic spider monkey. Energetic spider Six. monkey. Calm sloth. Calm sloth. Right, you see? 
Clam slug. Clam slug. Oh, this word very, very difficult to say. Yeah. Um, now you got the pronunciations. Okay. Running. So would you be able to? Would you like to listen again, or would you be able to repeat it right now? But I want to repeat it right now. Okay, go ahead. Let me see how you do it. Colorful macaw. Okay. Play it great. Okay. Dangerous dinosaur. Mm, let me help you with this one. Dangerous. 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 Jaguar. Jaguar. Oh, jaguar. Dangerous jaguar. Number four. Jaguar. Four. Okay. Friendly, friendly river dolphin. Okay, friendly river dolphin. And what is the next one? In a chicks. In a get takes spider monkey. Okay, energetic or energetic spider, spider, monkey. Monkey, sp energetic spider, monkey. Mm, it's gonna be energetic, energetic. Energetic, energetic spider, monkey. That's right. And then what is number six? Clam slot. Okay, clam slot. That's right. So yeah. let's continue. Clam slot. So now we are going to continue with this. So look at here, <clears throat> sorry. We are going to listen a number and then we are going to talk about the pictures. So let's see here. I am gonna play. Okay, can I take the, the pen, the pencil? Yeah, absolutely you can. Fantastic. Let me see. I am going to play the audio. Listen to this. Car listen carefully. I listen to all instructions that are in the information that are going to be given. Let's see here. So let me Did show you. What this dolphin was playing? <laughs> Page oh, 32. maybe because uh, hey, the painting was created. And number. It's one, two. Talk about the picture. Okay, here one. we go. Julie, look at that dolphin. Wow, it's pink. Excuse me, sir. What kind of dolphin is that? That's a river dolphin. They're very friendly. They live in South America. Two. There's a big cat next to the river. It looks dangerous. That's... Okay, what is number one? Number one is the dolphin, and the number picture two is the, the dangerous, the dangerous tracker. Okay, let me see. So, okay, listen to all that. So I can see that's different. Is that... Listen and number. Then talk about the picture. One. Julie, look at that dolphin. Wow. The dolphin. Excuse me. The dolphin. What kind of dolphin is that? That's a river dolphin. They're very friendly. They live in South America. Two. What? There's a big cat next to the river. It looks dangerous. That's a jaguar. It's Number smaller two. than a lion or a tiger, but it is dangerous. Three. Is that yellow and bluebird a macaw? It has colorful feathers. Yes, it is. We learned about them in school. There are 18 different kinds of macaws. There's a red and green one over there. I'm going to take a picture of it. Four. What kind of bird is that, Miss Spelling? It's white and has long wings. Here it is in our book. It's called an egret. They eat fish and frogs. I like the egret. 
It's plain, but it's very pretty. Five. Is that tree moving? Yeah, it's a spider monkey. It's climbing in the tree. There's a sloth in the tree, too. The spider monkey is energetic, but the sloth is calm. I think you're more like the spider monkey, Danny. Hey! Teacher, okay. I hear the first one they say is the dolphin. That is correct. Uh, you're right. The first one actually is the let's do something. What I'm going to do here, I see that uh, it, obviously we already listened to that. And the first one was supposed to be the dolphin. But that is no problem. What I want you to do now is to tell me the numbers. To tell me. I do it ready. Okay. So. Okay. So what is the num What is the name of this one? Um, the name of this one is Colorful Mako. Colorful Mako. And what about this one? Um, Plain Igrig. What about this one? Where did you? Um, Plum Squat. Um, let me say again. Say it again. Um, this one or this one? This one here in the tree. That's one. Okay. Calm slot. Calm slot. And this one? Um, a negative spider monkey. Spider monkey, that is correct. And what about this one? Um, dangerous jaguar. Jaguar. Dangerous jaguar. jaguar. That is right. And what about this one? Um, reverse dolphin. Well done. So now we have the sequence of numbers. Let me show you. Why this dolphin was pink? Well, maybe because they wanted to be more colorful. Maybe. But um, the idea is that, let me see. Let's do something. I am going to look for one of these. So this is... uh. River Dolphin. Let me look for this. Let's see if it's real color. Look at here. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. And look at this, Bonnie. Where? So apparently it's like that. Yeah. It's, it's like that. Look at here. Oh, what? It's pink. Wow, incredibly, incredibly amazing. Look at here. Apparently, apparently it's pink. See? Can't see. Incredibly amazing. Something from the nature. Okay, and the dolphin was pink. And we can find many of these animals in South America. Okay. Okay, so let's continue. Okay. So this is what we are going to do now, Bonnie. We are going to listen, say, and practice. <laughs> Let me show you something that is very important to me. So okay. how we compare adjectives. The way how we compare, uh, uh, compare adjectives in English, give me a second. The way how we compare adjectives in English. So, with, uh, for example, we have the word colorful. Colorful, we are going to say in English. More colorful. More colorful. But there are some adjectives in which we don't say like more colorful. We, don't, we do not, with some adjectives, we do not use more. We use ER, like in this case. Can you see here? Where? So, yes, I can see it. So we have plain, then you're going to say? Um, plain. And you, we have friendly. We have friendly here, but you're going to say? Friendly. Friendly. All right. That is correct. So it's like there are some adjectives that they do not use more. 
uh, instead they use e uh, they use instead er or i e r so at the end i'm referring to the to the ending look at here this part at the end of the center at the end of the word so they're going to have either i e r or e r for example this one can you read it um the last one summer that's right so then we have here so i am going to say the adjective and you are going to say the comparative let's see okay. number one okay colorful colorful then the More that is correct the comparative the comparative is going to be more colorful plain plainer dangerous more dangerous friendly friendly energetic more energetic <laughs> more energetic Bonnie, are you today? Are you tonight more energetic? Can you say it again? Are you tonight more energetic? Very. <laughs> I don't. More. Okay, in the morning, normally to be energetic, so we we take some coffee. You know, coffee yeah. here uh, allows us to be more energetic, to have an active day, and it's something natural. So let's see. What about the next one? Khan. In a teacher in a night, always I always I always watch a uh, watch a uh, movies. Oh, at night you watch movies? Yes, every oh, day. Very good. That sounds very good. And let me ask you something. What about Khan? Can you say it again? This one, Khan. Summer. Summer. That's right. Well done. So now we are gonna do this. So listen. we are going to listen the examples. So here we go. Give me a second. Okay, here it is. Page 33. See, listen and say, then practice. The macaw okay. is more colorful than the egret. Okay. Colorful. More colorful. Plain. Plainer. Dangerous. More dangerous. Friendly. Friendlier. Energetic. More energetic. Calm. Calmer. One. The macaw is more colorful than the egret. Okay. Two. The egret is plainer than the macaw. Okay. Three. The jaguar is more dangerous than the river dolphin. That's right. Four. The river dolphin is friendlier than the jaguar. Okay. Five. The spider monkey is more energetic than the sloth. Six. Sloth is calmer than the spider monkey. Okay. Can you compare the animals, Bonnie? Number one and number two. Okay. Number one, the macro is more colorful than the great. Number two, the great is Plain than the macaw. Plain, plainer than, okay. Plainer than the macaw. All right, number three. Um, the jackal, right? Ja jaguar. Jaguar. The jaguar was, the jaguar Is? was dangerous than, was more dangerous than the, the river dolphin. Okay. The river dolphin is is friendlier than the um the jaguar. Okay, and let's see um number five and number six. 
Number five is the um the spider monkey was spider. Okay, the spider. the spa, the actually the spider monkey was more energetic than well, the that's right. The sloth. He is is more energetic than the sloth. All right, and the sloth. The sloth was. Calmer than the spider monkey. The sloth is cal calmer than the spider monkey is. All right, <laughs> because in fact, in fact, is all right. Yes. So well done. Let me just continue with you. So here we are going to look at the sloth. It's very like scary. It's scary. Yeah. <laughs> not too much. Uh, let me just show you. Most. Let me just show you, Bonnie. So now we are going to listen, ask, and answer. And then after that, we are going to practice. So here we are having questions with uh, with mm -hmm. is and the verb to be. So for example, look at here. So you have this the first this example with the questions. Is the Macau more colorful than the egret, or is the Macau more more uh, is the Macau plainer than the egret? So then you're gonna answer, yes, it is, or not, it is not. Okay. Teacher, um, we are, I am do all of this, or we do together. So something I am gonna show you. So it's very important to mention, Bonnie, that when you are going to use is not is not you can reduce all right the pronunciation you can use like instead of saying is not you just say isn't and it's shorter do you understand that look at here so yeah. you say the telephone is not green is black but instead of saying is not you know, it takes longer to say, you reduce and say, isn't. Okay, I understand. Okay. So, the videos. let me just show you. Page 33. D. Listen, ask, and answer. Then practice. Let's practice with this. Listen is the and macaw practice. more colorful than the egret? Yes, it is. Is the macaw plainer than the egret? No, it isn't. Isn't. Is not. Okay. Is the macaw more colorful than the egret? Yes, it is. Two. Is the spider monkey calmer than the sloth? No, it isn't. Three. Is the jaguar more dangerous than the river dolphin? Yes, it is. Four. Is the sloth more energetic than the spider monkey? <laughs> no, it isn't. Five. Is the egret plainer than the macaw? Yes, it is. Six. Is the river dolphin friendlier than the jaguar? Yes, it is. Okay, so questions for you. Number okay. one. Is the uh, is the macaw more colorful than the egret? Yes, it. Yes, it is. yes it is. All right. So is the let me ask you something. Is the river monkey is the um, is the river monkey? I mean the is the is the 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 monkey? All right more active let's say for example than than the the slot the spider monkey I mean. okay is that, is that is that is that is that spider monkey is the spider monkey more active than the than the as uh, uh, sloth the cam sloth yes is it okay what about the number three what is number three? Is the jaguar, all right? Is the jaguar more dangerous than the river dolphin? Yes, it is. 
Okay, let me ask you something. Okay, is the, uh, all right, is the E grade, is the E grade uh, plainer than, let's say, for example, the, the, the dolphin? <laughs> Is the uh, the egret plainer than the dolphin? Yes, it is. Let me see number six. Let me see. No, it isn't. Is um the dolphin the river do the river dolphin? Okay. For example, more intelligent than the the jaguar. Yeah. Yes. Or I can tell you is the is the jaguar okay? Is the jaguar more dangerous than the dolphin? Yes. Of course. Okay, so let's continue. So, here I have a question for you, Bonnie. Does any does Teacher, I want to ask you, does any dolphin want to swallow the, the person? Mm, I don't think so, because I have the opportunity to see dolphins before me, especially in Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico, that is a part of the United States. It's an island of the United States. Uh, and, um, and I've seen before me, like, face-to-face -face dolphins. And we also say, uh, like, lunch fish, and they, they eat it. And I, they are not dangerous. Even so, they they even kiss people. Oh, I like it. They are very friendly and play with people. I never see like that. But, but I think the well will shallow the people. Well, well, yeah, that's yeah, that's possible. Yeah, they do. I saw a video of a I man. I was. I saw a video of a man that was shallow by, uh, by, by a whale, but then the, the whale just vomited the, the person. And he survived by, the, by grace. Oh my. Imagine, he was, he, the, the man was saying that, that the only thing he could see was a black thing all around him. So, but the, the whales, they are, you know, actually, that is, the, that depends. Okay, let's continue. Uh, number one, next, next one, we are going to look, point, and ask, and answer, all right? So, let me ask you this question. Is the jaguar, is the jaguar more dangerous than the river dolphin? Yes, it is. As we said before, yes, it is. So, now it's time to play. Play time. Okay, so here we go. Ready? Okay, ready? Let's see. Here we have the Christmas gift. All right. So do you want to choose one of the boxes, right? This is so I, like, I want to choose. I want to Let choose. Do the I want to choose the blue one. Okay, yeah. let's just start with the first one. Okay, the spider monkey, the spider monkey is energetic, but the slut is? Clam, clammer, clam. Con, all right. You have 10 points, good for you. Let's continue with the next one. The egret is? Um, colorful. Mm. Planer. Planer. Uh, the egret oh, yeah, is. The egret is. The egret is planer than the knuckle. Okay. <laughs> Let's continue. Oh my, 20 points. Santa, Santa uh, all right, Santa is happy. Let's continue. The spider monkey is? Is in 
energetic is energetic 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 that's right the spider monkey is more energetic than the sloth yeah. 25 points well done so let's continue the river dolphin is Okay. Friendlier, friendlier, friendlier than the jaguar. Friendlier than the jaguar. Let's continue. Is the macaw? The macaw is is the macaw is, is a question. Is the macaw more helpful? Than the e grid. Okay. So now let's review. Okay. okay. So Can let's review another link. Let re let's review the animals again. Give me a second. So let's review the names of these animals. Let's just let's just go back. Okay. So here they are. So look at the names of the animals. So the first one is? Colorful Maca. Okay, let me just go back right here so that you can see it. You can see them. Okay, the first one is? Colorful. Colorful Maca. The next one is? Plain. Plain E-grade. E -grade. Plain E-grade. All right, so, and this one? Dangerous Jaguar. Dangerous Jaguar. Okay, and this one? Friendly River Dolphin. That is correct. And this one? Energetic Spider Monkey. Energetic Cancel. Spider Monkey. Cancel that. All right. So that's pretty much it. Bonnie, let me give you a homework. This is page 33. Okay. Do you oh, have? Yeah. Do you have your workbook? Um, I get it enough. I... So what I'm gonna do is, uh, as you know, this is lesson. Actually, that is lesson four. So I want you to do the the homework that has to do with this page in your with these pages okay. in your in your workbook. Okay. Yes. Can you identify? Do you know which pages are these ones? Can you, can you give it to me? Uh, do you know which pages are this one? Can you identify these pages in in uh, in your workbook? Um. Okay. Let me let me tell you. In your student book, I think you have these pages to complete these exercises, which is pages. Uh, 33 and 34. Okay. I'm 33 and 34. That is going to be your homework. Look at here. Okay. Look, 33 and 34. Look I at here. So. Pages 33 and 34. That will be your homework for today. Okay. Well, Bonnie, thank you so much for your time. And I wish you have a nice rest of the day. Goodbye. Goodbye. Bye.